it's hard, as academics, you, you can't be making decisions about one technology in a positive light and other technologies in a negative light just because that's how you feel. Choices that you're constantly making when you're having conversations about whether you're making things more or less depressing. <laughs> and it's actively trying to keep the positive, positive parts of your brain engaged. Basically I'm saying, go and talk to some comedians. Hello, and welcome to season two of Conversations on Climate, the podcast series which has been developed in partnership with the London Business School's Alumni Andrews Club, which have been leading a series of conversations with experts from around the world exploring the biggest challenge of our time, climate change. Coming to you today from the 13th Annual Festival of Education held at the beautiful Wellington College. I can confidently say that today's guest is unique. Dr. Matthew Winning leads a double life as a successful academic and as a successful comedian. That fact alone is unusual, but the fact that he does exclusively climate change comedy is exceedingly rare. Climate change has long been neglected as a topic for comedians, and although it's getting more mentions in mainstream, what makes Matt unique is his credentials and depth of understanding on the subject from an academic perspective. A holder of a PhD in environmental economics at Strathclyde University, Matt has performed sold-out, full-length solo shows at the world-famous Edinburgh Festival. Is the author of Hot Mess, What on Earth Can We Do About Climate Change, and is host of the BBC radio programme Net Zero, A Very British Problem, and of the Operation Earth podcast. We discussed why is it important to laugh at such a serious subject, the secret to balancing lightness and tone with the complexities of climate change, the need for root and branch reform in economics, and much, much more. Matt is both a thoughtful and respected economist and a talented comedian. His burning passion to help solve climate change in both aspects of his work is abundantly clear and provides insights that you just won't want to miss. In the meantime, please subscribe on your app of choice to keep up with our new releases. I do hope that you enjoy listening to them as much as I enjoyed making them.